The 2012 world champion on a bowl bowl called Nailed. Alberta is known for its rodeo culture. And as the season was about to get in full swing, new provincial rules for social distancing stopped rodeos before the first rider left the chute. To me, it's, uh, it, ain't, it ain't no good. No way you look at it, really. Um, you know, I have to have find something else to do, I guess. Zeke Thurston is a professional saddle bronc rider competing in Canada and the United States. While he won't be riding in Alberta anytime soon, U.S. rodeos may go forward starting in July. Thurston has written off this summer, though, for his home province. I understand rodeo is, is a side effect of, of how your town or your economy is doing. Obviously, it's not going to be having rodeo. The places aren't doing great. But uh, by next summer, I'm sure a lot of this will be cleared up and figured out. One would hope, anyway. At least one summer event will go forward as best it can. Heritage Festival in August will now be a virtual event. I think it was very, um, very kind of the province to have made that decision on our behalf and, and to push it out when they did. To, it makes it a lot easier for us to move ahead now because you're not struggling with those decisions. Organizers tell us they hope people catch Heritage Festival online and order food or pickup for delivery. Our reach is so huge and the economic impact of this festival is so big to so many people in the city and all of northern Alberta that any way we can continue that outreach and help these groups to make a little bit of extra money is really important. Now the Heritage Festival is not the only group taking things to a virtual level. The city also plans to do a virtual fireworks show for Canada Day as they had to cancel the July 1st celebration. From Edmonton, Sherolta Saskew, City News.